Is it that TP Joshua knew he's going to buy Ellie? Because this evidence is the fear person, you know. She was the enemy of synagogue church. When she goes to school, she will steal money. And people will be like, why will the daughter of the man of God be stealing? It became very shameful. They never knew that she is not my daughter. They never knew that she was adopted. Until my church members, my team, went to the school and played the video of her adoption to the, to the school. They now said, no wonder, because a man of God's daughter shouldn't be stealing. These were the words that came out from T.B. Joshua's mouth. So many years ago, this video should be up to, up to 15 years old. T.B. Joshua dropped the receipt before he buy. Is it that this man knew that he's going to buy? Because this receipt is so, it's so scary. It's so very scary. Could it be that T.B. Joshua knew that, that he's not going to live long? How did he just drop this receipt? Countering the BBC report. Because BBC report reported that Ajoke is the daughter of T.B. Joshua. That was the report. And T.B. Joshua had already made this video so many years ago before he joined his ancestors. Eh? Now watch the video of the adoption. Introduce the Ajoke here to you. Ajoke, stand up. She is the one that is I'll lying there. Show them they the said day the woman allegedly her. dropped her there and ran away. That she was here for a very long time until the workers of the church picked her up. This was video made over it's more than 15 years. It's up to that girl should be up to 20 years now. So so a woman see this woman will come and pick her up. I think she should be one of the workers in the church. This was a very long time. Look at the church uh, setting then. It was very, very long. She has picked out. This one looks like the story of Moses. <laughs> You see the story of Moses that they pay they are princess found now, you see not that the princess found in the river. But this one they did not find her in the river, they found her in the church. So she don't pick her up, she will carry her go, maybe meet uh, T B Joshua. This was her and this is the baby too today. Look at like what even this is an old video. So I don't think uh, anybody will say it's uh, recorded, is this one, it's uh, maybe fake, it's a lie. It's the girl. This is a very, very old video and everything looks so so real and it's real not even so so there is no faking in it but who are asking now see how come this man kept all this now this was him and the baby i think when they were doing uh, when they want to do the adoption they told him why not adopt the baby instead of dropping her in the orphanage so true true adoption was adopted now this one when they talk say evidence day at least from this evidence now we know we've known that tb joshua is not a uh, joker's father but people are now saying that uh, that it could be arranged these are things people we are saying you know that it could be arranged maybe if you be the mother of the of the uh, joker which is uh, maybe you say tb joshua give the mother a belly you know maybe come drop the cookie in there it could be arranged me i don't know these are the things people were saying in the comment section but the whole thing they give me the goosebumps People we are commenting, someone like Mary Njoku, Iroko TV, a boss, boss's wife. Pastor, biological picking, no, they still. She looks exactly like him, though. An adopted daughter is also your daughter. So from that video, TB Joshua was, was trying to say that a joker is adopted, even bringing videos and everything, that he is not the real father and a joker is not his daughter. So that's why Mary Njoku is saying that. So Pastor, Pastor Pekin know they steal. So if true true that Ajoke was to be your daughter and then they steal, you go bring them in the group of so many people because these are like board of members of the church. So many of them. And they told her to stand up. You will see her. She's the one bending her neck. Ajoke, stand up. And so many things we have said about her. She could not even raise her face and look at anybody. People were saying that it's humiliation, that the lady was humiliated, that that was embarrassing and humiliation. That in that video, in fact, in that video, what you've been hearing, she stole this, she stole that, she stole this, she stole that, she's not my daughter, she's adopted. People are now saying that, oh, that is why the lady, like, she never felt that she was amongst them, that she felt like an outsider. 
That is why she was looking for her own identity. Because when that video we watched, it was all about you stole, you stole, you stole, and she stood up. She could not even look at them. That's how she was. Another person said, Georgie don't know her, said, she said that they should do DNA, they don't come again. Be like very dark man, don't teach you that DNA. And it's about to go say DNA. He said that they should do DNA from uh, Ajoke and TV Joshua's real children to know whether not the real pick. If you be real pick, you wait till I go come do. The man never by in the inside ground, they chill inside ground. <laughs> if that the real pick, nothing anybody can do about it. It is gone. It is gone. Will you wake him and do what? And beat him and do what? Or maybe give him. Give her the father's their property or what? I don't think there is need for DNA in this case. People should leave DNA and make him rest. So these were the opinion of people. The main cocoa of this video is that TB Joshua said he's not the father of Ajoke. As alleged by BBC that said that Ajoke is the daughter of TB Joshua. And said TB Joshua, they abu, 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 abu the girl. Someone said that everything is wrong with the video. You found a child, you took her home, you raised her. So how come, at what point did she start stealing? How was she raised? That's the question the person they asked, not me they asked. She said, how was Ajoke raised to the point she started stealing, taking things that does not belong to her? Is it that you people did not provide for her, that she does not have any option that to start taking things from people and to start taking you people's money? That is what someone was asking on the internet. It is quite unfortunate that this man is no longer here to defend himself. Because if he were to be here, he would have said things physically and even provided more evidence. But this is shocking, you know. How could this man keep this, keep this evidence? This one is evidence day. For over 20 years, this evidence day. Someone saying, okay, since you people have answered to this allegation, now this was one of the allegations. What happened to the other allegations? That they want to see videos countering those claims. Do you find the video funny? Because some people say they don't find it funny. That it was a humiliation on the girl's part. You understand? Do you think the girl was humiliated? Or do you think she was cautioned to stop being an enemy in synagogue church?